Experiment 1B. Determine concentration of a solution using titration. Dispense the NaOH from the dispenser into a clean beaker. Make sure the stopcock is take off. Just pull it up and push it back downward. Transfer the NaOH solution from the beaker to the burette. Make sure the stopcock of the burette is turned off, switch off, and then fill the burette with the NaOH solution carefully by and use the filter funnel. Take the initial reading from the bottom of the meniscus and record it in a suitable table. You have to make sure there are no air bubbles at the tip of the burette. So how to remove the air bubble so you have to switch on and off the stopcock as fast as possible and see whether the air bubble is is gone next dispense 25 centimeter cube sample of HCl into a clean conical flask Two to three drops of indicator into the HCl. This is how you do the titration. If you are right handed, your left hand will hold the stopcock and your right hand will hold the conical flask. Just use three fingers to control the stopcock as shown in the video. Once rolling, run the NaOH into the acid. When you can see the color change develops, which starts to persist, start to add the NaOH dropwise. Stop the titration at the point at which the color change is permanent, even on swirling. This is the end point. Record the volume shown in the burette. The color change you should get in this experiment is the pale pink. Check if you have sufficient amount of NOH in the burette for another titration. Wash out your conical flask and refill with another 25 ml of HCl. Repeat the titration until you have 3 sets of data with titration volumes.